going to show you a wee game here. Um, it's for loosely walking, but also for recall. So what it is, it's called zigzag walking. Um, what we're going to do is I'm going to walk away. And um, as I walk, I'm going to have little Torin here next to me. Then I'm going to throw a treat out in front of me. As I throw a treat out in front of me, I'll cut behind and I'll zag to the other direction. So you're going in a zigzag kind of um, pathway. Okay, what will happen is as I cut behind him, he'll go to pick that treat up, then he'll come and find me in position next to my reinforcement zone, which is next to my leg, and I'll say yes and throw a treat out, and then I'll zag the other way. Okay, so what it looks like is a little bit like this. So I'm going to walk away to start off with. I'm going to bring him in to walk. I'm going to go yes, throw a treat, walk behind him, yes, throw a treat. treat out behind him. He's gonna find me. Yes! So I treat that way. Just gonna wait for him to find the treat. Yes! So I treat. Yes! So I treat. So I hope that kind of shows you how it works. He's on a lead at the moment. But if I take him off the lead, he'll be pretty much the same thing. So we'll try it again off lead. So I'm gonna walk around. when he throws it into long grass. Yes. And then I'll turn around and come back. Yes. 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 Trying to find the treats. Yes. And then we can bring him back in. As you can see, Every time I walk away, I'm cutting him behind so he sees that and he comes back to follow me. Okay, it's a good way to create more focus. They're coming to find you and you can do it if you're in a big field, you can walk much further. You could even run away at zip, different zigzags. So cut behind, throw a treat, run away, throw a treat, run away. Okay, so adds that extra little bit of focus into uh, otherwise quite boring straight walk or a boring straight um, run whatever off lead or on lead okay thank you